Welcome to the channel everyone. Uh, today I got the S10 uh, in the shop, Project Junk S10. Just uh, gonna do a quick video on this. I haven't done a video on it for a while. Kind of an update video. Um, if you notice on here, uh, this bumper is tweaked down. Now I don't know if my grandpa did it or my brother-in-law, but I'm gonna try to uh, jack that up and, and, and get that bent back. It just looks terrible. Uh, I eventually want to maybe do like a custom bumper on this thing, but for right now I'll settle with that being uh, fairly straight. So I'm just going to get a jack out and try to jack it up. But uh, yeah guys, I haven't showed this truck in a while and uh, this thing this thing will never be sold. Uh, I'm never going to sell it because it was my, my grandpa's last truck. So. Um, this thing you'll never see a, a, a sold video on this truck guys, but Anyway, it's it's hotter than heck outside. It's 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 better in the shop here, so I'm just gonna try to fix this bumper today, and, and we'll go from there Okay, so I'm just using a floor jack and a block of wood and and Jacking it up using the weight of the truck to, to bend this bumper back up. I'm not exactly sure what was hit but I really need to jack it up on this corner here, but I really can't get to it because that that air dam. I jacked up the the brace in here, and I got this uh, looking good, but I really need to jack it up right around here to get that up. You can see there's a tweak right here in the bumper. A really good tweak. I didn't know it was that bad, but it's tweaked pretty good there. So I'm going to keep working on this thing and trying to get that gap a little better. Okay, so I'm pretty happy with that. I realize I'm not going to get this perfect and it really don't matter because the bumper's damaged in the middle anyway. I just want it so it's not so obvious that the bumper was tweaked. Now, when, when these bumpers get tweaked on the outside edges, guys, you've seen me using a hammer back here. Most of the time, the problem is with these side braces. See, there's a side brace right here. And that is, most of the time, is that's the problem when the ends of these bumpers get tweaked. So I jacked it up, put some pressure on it, hammered the uh, brace behind it to kind of tweak the bumper back into place. Now I did, I was going to take this off, but there are, this is the craziest balance I've ever seen. There's push pins that hold it on the end here, two of them. Then it's uh, it's got like clips right here, but then there's another two push pins in the center there, and you can't access them. Uh, I'm guessing until the bumper comes off. So, because there's some weird kind of a plastic thing in there, and you can't get these uh, plastic rivets out. So I just moved it out of my way, and there's enough flex in it. So. I'm happy. For 15, 20 minutes uh, worth of work, uh, the bumper looks a lot better. I'm gonna get this reassembled and we'll take a look at it. So, there it is guys. I'm pretty happy with that. I mean, if you weren't looking for it, I don't think you'd even notice the bumper being a little bit, it might be a little down further on this side but not much. I'm not gonna complain about that. Like I said, 15, 20 minutes of my time here, and uh, it looks like I got a, a fairly straight front end, so I'm happy with that. So I guess that's gonna do it for this one, guys. Um, I guess just a quick update and a bumper tweak. 
on uh, Project Junk S10. Like I said, I'd, I'd like to make a custom bumper for this. Just haven't figured anything out. Maybe add a winch, a winch to the front. But I don't know. I guess if you guys have any ideas, let me know in the comments and uh, maybe I can uh, start figuring something out for this. Anyway guys, I guess I'll see you.